your top three favorite producers to work with? You know, I seen that you have a lot of tracks with GDP, Sip and Dirty, and Band Up. You know, so who are your top three to work with? The crazy thing about it, uh, a lot of the producers be young as shit. Like, I don't think I ever worked with one a nigga over 16. Like, a lot of them be young. But my favorite producers to work with is Global Dre Productions. I fuck with him. I feel like I be talking to him, like, I be texting him, like, bro, you don't even know. You really got a different sound, show. you like, you a little Kanye, like, you a little Andre 2000. But he be so much in his homework and schoolwork, he just, he make beats on his spare time. But he him. I be telling him, show you like that, just keep on doing what you're doing. To the point I get on all your songs and really get you there. Sipping Dirty. I fuck with Sipping Dirty. Another young nigga. I got on his songs. Another thing. I get on these niggas' songs and now the whole city won't work with them. But that's cool. That was the purpose. That was the whole plan. That's, you know, that's what I want for them. I want them to work. But I fuck with Sipping Dirty, Global Dre. And my third and final one, I fuck with uh, MJ and Reds. MJ and Riz, they uh, they uh, did a lot of artists like Keezy Banks, motherfucking Cutiful, Shabazz. My fault, take Cutiful out of there. Shabazz, they got a lot of artists they work with. But I fuck with MJ and Riz, they like that. So, yeah, so since we on that topic, right, how do you feel about artists, you know, listening to your song and because you rap on it, they go and jump on the song? Yeah, I feel like um, it's all, it's, it's, it's what was your purpose to me? Like, was right. it a good thing? Like, you want to show, like, I fuck with bands, so I'm going to hop on this. Or what you want? Like, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Because I caught a lot of artists doing that. But a lot of artists that I see do that, they don't like me. So it'd be right. like, what you want? What you think? You better than me or something? I'm like, what's up, y'all? They like, what? Throw me off. How do you feel about certain artists that kind of, you know, press bloggers, producers, um, Interviewers to kind of like pick a side when it comes to their street politics. I know. Yeah, I feel like uh, it's like high school. It's like you know when a nigga ain't on certain shit. Well, not even high school, regular life shit. But I'm gonna go to high school for the viewers. As you know when somebody ain't how you are, or you know when somebody ain't on certain shit. I feel like that's what they see with. The fucking uh, producers and shit. Producers, they fans too. Basically, what I'm trying to say. My fault, y'all. I be having a lot of shit in my head. I can't really say it how I want to say it. The word would be crazy. The producers know that. I mean, the uh, artists know that producers be fans. They real like get them on some pimp shit because they fanboys. That's how it is. They pick a side. They fans. You know I mean, they fans of them niggas. That's how that was. They, they love them niggas. They crank them niggas in the car. They fans. Right. So they gonna pick that side. I, him, 100K, 200K, I love it. They gone all the numbers. It is what it is. That's how this shit go. You know what I mean? That's how this shit go. Okay, so like, do you think that it's wrong that uh, that an artist or or the friends of an artist will try to press somebody out because they made a beat for an artist that they don't like or somebody mm -hmm. they tour or they post yeah, that's, somebody? Yeah, that's definitely tour. wrong because like, like I said, uh, you, for example, you my man. You post who you post. You DC yeah. artist though. I can't get right. mad at that, bro. That's your job. That's your business. That's what give you your engagement. Right. I even tell niggas on the block, man, da da da. But he do this, like that's his job, y'all. That's what give him his engagement. That's what his most fucking views come at. That's his most likes come at. You get what I'm saying? Right. I can't get mad at you, but that's me. I'm a real nigga. Some niggas ain't real. You get what I'm saying? I ain't mad that I do beats with. Other people, yeah. don't give them my beat though, bro. I ain't on that. Stop right. what you doing. Fuck y'all think it's it. This nigga say, he told my ass, yeah, bro, I been gave him that. Stop what you doing. The shit they saying in the song is new. Come on, stop fucking right. doing. <laughs> weird ass song. So my been gave him that jump. Fuck on, bro. Shit bad business. I don't mind y'all. You can work with whoever. I don't give a fuck. Yeah, it's money. They paying that money as whatever. I don't give a fuck. Respect, respect. Well, I think that's all, folks. Glad to have you here. Rubber band. No problems, no problems. Hopefully we got we get some more interviews and this shit, man. You know, keep this shit going, man. Rubber band, man. My love for life. I already know what the fuck going on. Had to come in and fuck with DC, man. <laughs>